Hey guys, how you doing today? Got a hot one going up here on the roof. Um, so I decided to make uh, for dinner tonight seared tuna with a mango pico de gallo. And uh, so I started to think, what am I going to serve with this sandwich? Uh, it, it hit me. Uh, one of the first times I was at La Esquina here in the city, downtown, a couple next to me was having a drink called the Michelada. I'm like, what the hell is a Michelada? By the way, it happens to be one of my more favorite words these days, kind of like spatchcocks. <laughs> Michelada, very manly, Michelada. Um, drank it, thought it was really cool. Basically, it's beer with clamato or tomato juice. It has a little bit of uh, soy sauce and Worcestershire in it, fresh squeezed lime juice. Um, we're gonna salt the rim, uh, which I've already pre uh, pre moistened the moist moistened the, the glass with some lime juice. And in a moment, we're gonna salt the rim. And then we're gonna make a simple michelada. It's actually a really great drink in in the um, in the summertime. So. I like a mason jar, one of the bigger glasses that I had around, and I, let's see if we can get this And I had, um, already did the rim, already did the rim with lime juice, so we'll put that over there, I'm going to add ice into the glass. We have our ice, we have our lime. I'm using it as a stir, believe it or not. It's actually a really pretty garnish. So that being said, it calls for about, the recipe calls for 12 ounces of beer and 12 ounces of, of Clamata. But I'm just gonna go ahead and put in, I'm gonna go with a cup of clam otta. Right. And it calls for about a quarter cup of fresh squeezed lime. But since, let's bring this back over here. Let's get this out of our way. But since I'm not doing the full 12, 12 ounces of each, I'm just gonna do the juice of one fresh squeezed lime. get that going so we have our lime juice in there and then it calls for a couple tablespoons one tablespoon of uh, Worcestershire sauce so I'm just gonna eyeball that out it's about right and it calls for about a tablespoon of soy sauce I'm gonna eyeball that out seems about right even though the recipe I'm using my Handy dandy chili. There we go. Even though the recipe doesn't call for it. A little spice never hurt anybody. And it calls for 12 ounces of beer. But if I use 12, it would overflow. So again, about, about 10 ounces of beer. And that very simply is a michelada and if you don't like the way it looks you can stir it a little better there you go there you have it a michelada it's a great summertime drink let's see how we did oh yeah it's not only that good <laughs> it's perfect what a great summer drink. Mexican food, really any spicy food, it's phenomenal. Oh, I could drink 10 of these. And you say, ew, Clamata juice and beer? I'm telling you guys, try this recipe. I'll post it later on to the site. Yeah, it's that good. Fourth of July is coming.
might be a nice addition to your menu depending on what you're making. Uh, stay tuned later. We'll be serving up that mango pico de gallo and the grilled tuna. Uh, I'm going to be serving on a ciabatta bread and I might throw in a spicy lime cilantro aioli uh, on the bread as well. I don't know. Seems just like the thing to do right now. Guys, thanks for stopping in. Be well, be safe, and see you again real soon.